five minutes to a vocal chop riff? Yes, please. One of the biggest sounds in today's pop and EDM is vocal chops. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you in five minutes how to get a wicked vocal chop riff like this. There are other ways to achieve vocal chops, but this is the way I do it for the quickest results. So without further ado, let's hop into the door and get it done. So if you just want to kind of embellish the vocal track that's already there rather than doing a completely fresh vocal chop riff, which we're going to look at in another video, this is what I did for this one. So the first thing to do is make sure that you've got the correct warp mode selected. So select Complex Pro, make sure it's all in sync with your track. I feel it in my body. And then add your embellishment. So I'm going to create a new audio track. I'm going to call it vocal fx because i can't be bothered to type embellishments and then i'm going to slice this body Bye. because that's what i want to be delayed so i hold command and e to slice it then i'm going to hold alt and drag it into my new track where i want the delay to happen which would probably be there Bye. Bye. but i want it pitched down so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go to transpose minus 12 that's minus 12 semitones which is a whole octave and then you can play with this formant as well. So this is how it sounds at the moment, pitched down. Bye. But if we put the formants to zero, Bye. you've got that kind of deep male voice almost. So now here's what we've got. I feel it in my body. Feel it in the night. And then I want night to be delayed as well, but in a different way. So I'm just going to, I just want the beginning of it delayed. So. I'm going to grab it, bring it down onto my effects track, and then do a bit of kind of sample repeat effect on it. And I want it to be a kind of staccato stutter, so I'm just going to fade it out to make it into a stab rather than a sustain sound. And then the last one, I'm going to extend it so it is actually a full delay. So now we have got Except I'm going to add a bit of stereo width there and for that I'm going to use the completely free Ozone Imager by Isotope. You can just download it from their website, it's a great little plugin. And I'm going to add some stereo width to this. And I'm going to press the Stereoize button. And then up the width. And if you're listening in stereo, you can hear how wide that now sounds. So now we have this effect. Which is pretty cool. And then I'm going to add some added pitch bends to make it a bit more interesting, a bit more like a vocal chop, kind of DJ snake type loop. And what I'm going to do is again, chop the bits, um, chop the vocal on the transient. In fact, I just, I'm just going to use that, that first um, syllable. I'm going to copy, uh, sorry, I'm going to drag it so it hits exactly on time. And again, I want this to be a kind of staccato hit. And then I'm going to show you what I do with the pitch. Again, it's on Complex Pro. And then we can play with the transpose and each one step is a semitone or one semitone is obviously a semitone. So let's have a listen. And if you want, you can actually write out a rhythm in a MIDI instrument, just like a grand piano to help you as a template when you're adjusting the pitch because, and you know, it can be a bit confusing. But I'm kind of, I know what I want in my... And I want that one to go down. So now we have got... And if you fancy a different sound rather than the same chop repeated, you can just grab a chop from somewhere else. So let's bring it back and see what... Yeah. 
So that is how I do a vocal chop in about five minutes. I hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for the next video when I will show you how to do vocal chops with a bit more control, but it does take longer using a sampler. When I've done that video, I will post it in one of these boxes that are about to pop up. If you want to know how to write really catchy melodies really quickly with no music theory background, check out the video below and in five minutes you'll be well on your way. I hope you enjoyed this video guys, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, thanks for subscribing and until next time, cheers and happy producing.